Okay, I'm back. Today we're going into the uh, Walmart Supercenter and we're going to do a little shopping. So let's go in there and see what kind of prices we're looking at. The last time I did this, I got some pretty good views, so I decided, you know what, let's update about a year later. So let's go into the uh, Walmart Supercenter. Okay, so I'm in and let's uh, get ourselves a nice shopping cart here and lots to choose from. Okay, let's uh, start this thing. You gotta bring your own bags, people. You gotta bring your own bags. The plastic stuff's all gone. Okay, let's get to the uh, first aisle there. I usually uh, go and uh, do my meats first. So let's get to the uh, meat department. And there it is, there's the meat. Let's see what we got here. I'm hoping they have uh, some stuff. Uh, this is kind of like a, a Sunday. And, uh, <laughs> and sometimes all the good stuff's gone. Okay, some boneless sirloin here. 11.62. This packet. And uh, let's see what else we got here. Looking for some pork side ribs. one will do. Nine dollars and thirty cents people. <laughs> All right. Don't need any chicken uh, right now. In the bacon section I pick up a little back bacon. 767. And uh, I toss over to get some lemons. I got addicted to uh, lemon water. It's supposedly uh, good for you. I'll see if uh, I'll see if it's any uh, good. Sometimes uh, this is the leftover stuff, you know. Four dollars and eighty-seven cents. This kind of looks good. This is a fruit section here. The veggies. Yeah, the old melon section. I haven't had one of these all summer. Summer's almost over, so I think I'll grab one. See if I can do it with one hand. <laughs> okay. That's five bucks. They have a deli department in this store, but uh, this is a Sunday, a Sunday morning, so uh, they don't have the, uh, they have a really good special, eight eighty-seven for a whole chicken, but they don't have any out. I think they're either cooking it or they're out of it, <laughs> so I don't know, but I usually pick one up. And uh, let's go over to the luncheon meats. I should stay away from this stuff, it's not very good. And I think I will. Okay, let's uh, get to the bread section. This stuff here, it's like 387. Pick up some of this keto bread. Ugh, stuff's expensive. Uh, that's uh, that's the raw. <laughs> That's not the correct price, unless they have it in special. Let's see. Uh, nope. It's in the wrong section. This is like seven bucks. <clears throat> six and six seventy something. It's like seven bucks. Okay. That's usually all I get here. I will um, take a look at the uh, luncheon meat. Five ninety-seven. 
should stay away from this stuff, but I get lazy sometimes. I don't feel like, uh, you know, cooking. <laughs> this aisle here, I usually get nothing. But I'll go down as the coffee cereal aisle. I don't buy anything down this aisle here. So. Let's get out of this aisle. Some of the specials in the middle here. Okay. This aisle here, I usually don't get anything either. Okay. This aisle is nothing I need, uh, which is like your pasta sauce. Uncle Ben's stuff, rice and noodles and canned corn. Don't need any corned beef, I got some at home. And of course you got your tuna. I got stuff at home, so. This aisle, nothing I didn't need. Okay. Uh, I don't need any uh, pickles. I already got that at home. Two jars of it. You can pick up your artificial sweeteners here. But I do need some walnuts. Okay. Make sure it's not uh, too many bad stuff and bad ones in here. <laughs> Sometimes you get a bag full of black, all the leftover stuff that they don't want to, they shouldn't, they should have thrown away. But anyways, these two bags look pretty good. Uh, Five ninety-seven for each bag. Okay. Then here you got your vinegar and. You get your spices and stuff. Don't need any this week. Okay, so I'm looking for some hamburgers. Patties. Let's grab a look here. There's one that I usually buy right here. 768. Okay. Great value. That's a French side beef burger. All right. Sorry about the camera work there. Okay. This is an aisle I usually don't get anything. This is like the. Uh, well, actually, I. I do. <laughs> I need to get some pop. Uh, shouldn't uh, be drinking this stuff, but you know. Okay, I'll get the uh, Walmart great value, 97 cents for these puppies here, a little Diet Coke. Um, and uh, I think I'll pick up two of these Diet Cokes. This is the uh, section where you have all kinds of water, bottled water. I should get a case. Sometimes they have it like really dirt cheap, like two bucks. <laughs> I don't know where to get the water from, but... <laughs> Anyways, oh, what do we got here? Spring 12 pack, $1.97. Um, let's see here. Is this it? Let me check and see. I'll be right back. No, that wasn't it. I think they sold out. <laughs> I would have bought it for two bucks. Anyways, let's get out of this aisle. There's nothing else I need. It's bad enough I came down here. Diet pop, really bad for me. <laughs> let's get out of this aisle. Okay, this aisle I usually don't come down, but I think I need to get uh, No, I don't need any chocolate bars. <laughs> With potato chips, 
and uh, cookies and chocolate bars, I think. Anyways, I got past here without uh, getting anything. Here's where all the, uh, I guess the, uh, like, cat food and dog food stuff. I don't have any pets, so I don't need to have to spend any money in this aisle. Okay. Okay. Fruit juices. I don't buy fruit juices. I gotta make sure that, uh, I'm getting a little older now. I gotta make sure my sugar is under control. Don't need any laundry bleach or detergent these are the mops and all the fun stuff okay so we can get out of this aisle okay now we're going to be entering the frozen food aisle ice cream and waffles and frozen chicken wings and all the fun stuff. Frozen veggies. None of this stuff I buy. I used to. I used to live off this uh, pizza stuff here. But not anymore. Not anymore. Right in front of us, you got milk. More frozen food stuff. Yogurt. Eggs. I'm okay with the eggs. I am addicted to this stuff, so I stay far away. <laughs> Sometimes I fall off the wagon when it comes to ice cream, but... Um, uh, myself and ice cream. Uh, I know what it's like to be addicted to something. Anyways, let's, let's grab some cheese here. Okay. This is uh, six bucks for this water cheese. All right. That is the, um, the grocery portion. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to do a quick little run through part of the store. It's a big store give you a gist of what else is in here. I won't say much, I'm just gonna take it down a few aisles. Whoops. Arts and crafts. Bedding, pillows. As a matter of fact, I better take a quick look. No, I wouldn't. Uh... Anyways, some carpeting. You got a section down here, you got uh, your tools, hardware stuff. Just a quick run through. Maybe one day I'll do a full store tour. But this is the best I can do. You got uh, bicycles and toys down here. And uh, okay. you got your shoes. Down here, clothing. Uh, this is the men section, men active wear here. Looks like kids. <laughs> That's way over there. <clears throat> this is the kids section, fitting room over there. And uh, a quick run through the electronics. So. TVs, oh, let's take a look down here, let's grab a look, okay, so we got uh, printers, gaming, okay, and we have a clearance section here as well too. 
stuff that didn't sell. Oh, your diapers, strollers, and um, let's see what else we got going on here. What's down here? Oh, uh, I don't know what this stuff is. Um, oh, formula. <laughs> Uh, okay. Okay, in here I gotta pick up some toothpaste. So they have that cordons off. <laughs> See what we got here. Uh, Two dollars and sixty-seven cents. <laughs> okay. Let's get out of this section. I don't know why they have a cordon so off, but uh, they made it two separate sections. They stuck the toothpaste with the uh, cosmetics. So you can buy cosmetics. Okay. And I gotta pick up some vitamin pills. So I gotta go to the pharmacy section, and you can see hair dryers and shampoos and creams here. Let's go in here real fast. Uh, I gotta go back to the um, the vegetable and stuff section. I gotta pick up some something I forgot, some ginger. <laughs> Anyways, let's grab a look here. I think this is what I'm looking for. This is uh, $20.97, some lutein. Oh. This, that bottle looked a little bit uh, beat up. Okay. Looks like the plastic. Is the plastic still on this thing? Usually there's plastic on this. Sorry for the crazy. Uh, oh well. There used to be plastic in the top cover there. When it comes to that stuff, you got to make sure that no one's tampered with it. Okay, so. Just a quick, oh, the pharmacy's not even open yet. <laughs> See this little wall of uh, wallness here? That uh, usually, uh, that's where the pharmacy, I guess they open a little later in the day. It's not that, uh, it's not that uh, early. It's about 10 o'clock in the morning, you know. But it's not quite open. Anyways, so this is, what I'm, this is what's gonna happen. I am gonna go down to the um, vegetable and fruit section and pick up some ginger. Okay, so I'm back at the uh, section where they sell ginger and the fruits and vegetables. I'll pick some up and head to the cashier. Okay, just checked out. And what are we looking at here? Let's see if you can focus in. Uh, 120, 126. 126 bucks worth of stuff there. So, we're going to walk out of here and go home. This is a self-checkout area here. Okay. Yep. Two, uh, two bags worth of fun. And this is what $126 worth of groceries looks like. <laughs> $126. <laughs> Anyways. And, uh, I usually uh, buy more, uh, but uh, this is one of those weeks I had a surplus of stuff. So, anyways, I'm in the parking lot. Hope you enjoyed this little visit to the uh, local Walmart there, Superstore. And if you like this, I'll make more vids like this. So, uh, please like and subscribe, and I'll make more vids when I get a chance. 126 bucks. Welcome to Toronto. <laughs>